He's a wonderful Savior. Amen. Yes. Hallelujah. I ain't got no oil. I just got a scripture I want to read. It's in Psalms 92. Psalms 92 and 1 says, It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord, to sing, sing praises unto thy name, O Most High, to show forth the love, love and kindness in the morning and thy faithfulness every night. <laughs> it's a good thing. Amen. Be thankful. Amen. Amen. I'm thankful for everything that he does for. I'm thankful for my... My family, my, my my children, my grandchildren, and and, and my church families. Amen. As you as you step out and start family, you get a lot of church families. You ain't got just one no more. You got a bunch of them. Amen. Amen. And I'm thankful for every one of them. You know that lifts us up in prayer and and everything he does. The Bible says, you know, we should give thanks in all things. Amen. And everything, give thanks, because this is will of God, Christ Jesus. Amen. According to everything, it don't matter what it is. What kind of, even even brother Bill, when we're in, it seems like we're in the hardest battle. Come on. If we just look a little bit, you'll find something to give me praise for. Amen. Amen. I was thinking back here a while ago about that story that I heard, I don't know, years ago, about a man that was on the way to church, and as he was going down, uh, going to going to church, he got beat up, got mugged. Got robbed, Brother Billy. Yeah. Amen. But he went on and went on into church and he had his clothes torn. He was lifting up the name of Jesus and praise the Lord. And somebody come by and asked him, he said, What do you got to be so thankful for? You just got loved out there? He said, First of all, I'm thankful they didn't kill me. Amen. He said, Second of all, I'm thankful that I didn't have a whole lot of money. Yeah. So they didn't get much. Yeah. But he said, but most of all, I'm thankful that I'm the one that got robbed and not the one that done the robber. Amen. Amen. We got something to be thankful for. Yes. Amen. Even in the valleys, we can find something to praise him for. Amen. Amen. Paul and Silas, when they was in prison, Brother Billy, when they, when they, found, they, they started praising him and started lifting him up and giving thanks to God. Oh. Honey, that thing started rocking. That's how it started oh, rocking. And, and, and everybody was loosened in that place. Amen. Yeah. Prayer changes things and lift the praises. Honey, you can praise your way out. Brother Hint told me it years ago. Yeah. Any situation you get in, you can praise your way out of it. Amen. Amen. And I'm thankful for everything that God has done for me. Amen. This past year, I probably preached more than I've ever preached, Brother Billy, since I've been preaching. Amen. And I thank God for that, that He's opened up doors where I can walk in and get to preach. And Sunday morning at Sassy Fresh Church, uh, there, there was a lady that come in, and she come in late. Well, there's two of them come in late. This, this one girl comes to the other. Brother Bill, when she come in, she was hurting in her side real bad. And she was even crying. And she said she didn't mean to interrupt the service, but she needed prayer. I said, you ain't interrupt the service if you need prayer. Yeah. So we, we gathered around her, and we, and we took the whole bottle, we anointed her with the whole, and we prayed, you know, and, and and she got to feel a little better. And we went ahead and had service, and I preached, and, and I answered the service, and the Lord laid on my heart to give an altar call, and that lady comes to that altar. And give her life to Jesus. Amen. Church, that's what it's all about. I'm Amen. thankful for that today. Honey, it ain't about getting getting offers. It ain't about the, uh, getting glory for anything. It's about winning a soul to Jesus. Amen. Amen. I'm so thankful today that somebody told me about him. Somebody took time to pray. Honey, if, if you can't take if somebody comes in here and they're hurting and they need prayer, if you can't take time to pray for them, you might as well lock the door. Because that's what it's supposed to be all about. It ain't about us. It's all about Jesus. Amen. And I'm so thankful for him and that blood that he shed on Calvary for us. Amen. I'm thankful for that today. I don't really understand it. Probably never will, brother. But why he would do that for me? But I know that I know that I know that he did. And I'm thankful today that, that I know, brother Billy. When I lay down at night, I don't have to. Fear, I don't. Worry, I don't fear death. I ain't no hurry to get to die, but I don't fear it, Brother Bill, because I know that I know where I'm going to go if I leave this world. I couldn't always say that. Amen. But if you know Jesus, you ain't got no reason to fear it. Really? Because we know where we're going. Amen. Yeah. Now, if you don't know Him, honey, you got plenty of reason to be praised. Amen. And I'm thankful for that today. I'm thankful for everything He does and every, every, everybody that He places in my life and every message that He gives me. Every opportunity, brother, we take it for granted so many times. Every opportunity we got to come in front of the house, I'm thankful for that. Yeah. 
Amen. The opportunity that I, I I'm thankful for His Word. The opportunity that we have to, that we still got His Word in this country. The old classic on. King James Version Bible. On, we amen. still got it. We're still we're still able to get to come together and preach His Word and stand upon His Word. Because every answer, every problem you got, whatever you want through in life, right here is your answer. Yeah. It's in here. This is what when, when the devil, when the tempter comes to tempt Jesus. This is what He used. Amen. He said it is written. Yeah. And that's what we got to do. When the doctor said it ain't no hope, he said it is written by his stripes. I am you. Oh, Amen. When, when they say that you done, done got out in the world too far, you ain't no way you're going to take it. He said, it is written. Whoever call upon my name shall be saved. But it's never too late. Amen. It is written. We stand upon his word. I'm thankful for that word. I'm thankful that I've got it down in my heart. Amen. I'm thankful that I'm able. I ain't the best in the world, but I'm able to read his word. Amen. I'm thankful for everything. So we take everything for granted. Amen. I remember a story about a young boy wanted a real expensive pair of shoes. And he told a fit in the store, brother Billy, want them shoes. His mama finally just grabbed him up and said, you ain't getting them. Took him outside and he was still throwing them in. But then all of a sudden there come a woman pushing up a little old wheelchair with a little girl in it that didn't have no feet. Then them shoes weren't so important to him no more. He was thankful that he had feet, honey. We better be thankful for what we got, amen. Sometimes we don't get no more because we ain't thankful for what we got, amen. I'm thankful to the Lord has always provided for us, amen. Even, even if it was just a rabbit to eat, he's made a way, amen. He's made a way. Would have seemed to be no way, amen. amen. And he's gonna take care of his people. Amen. Because it is written. And if we're standing on it, he's gonna take it. He's gonna see us through. Amen. If we're standing on his word, he'll see us through. Amen. If we'll seek him first. Seek ye first, the kingdom of God and his righteousness. And everything else is gonna be added to it. That's his promise. Amen. amen. And he's a man that cannot lie. And I'm thankful for everything he does for me. I'm done. Amen. amen.